Welcome back, everybody, to Steam Powered. Oh, I'm about to do an informational episode here. Not really. I'm just going to explain my progress over time. Uh, just because I've been doing a lot of progress off camera. Just because this mod's not like... I guess you can do it on camera, but it's a whole lot of just having to collect brass. Like, I need a lot of brass to make all of this. All these heads I've been collecting uh, with Dakota in the uh, Twilight Force. But I will do my own episodes for that. Uh, that's what he's been doing. So I cleared out this area finally. Uh, thanks to Ryan. This uh, mortar that I got going on here just... It's just not how it used to be. It shoots up. And, uh, I don't like where it comes back down. I don't like where it comes back down. Look. Fucking Ryan. My asshole. Don't worry, I'll get him back later. But yeah, I'm gonna show you guys my progress here. Explain a couple of machines and then maybe accomplish something in this episode. So thanks to Unlucky Blocker, I guess. It's even considered a lucky blocker. I now own 500 cats, I think. Probably. I own a lot of cats, I can tell you that. Thanks, Lucky Blocks. Uh, and here's the thing I was talking about. I made a lot more automatic this time around, though. Well, not this time around. I made a lot better. Uh, there's probably a lot of upgrades for that, but like I said, I never said this. But I don't know much about the monster. Uh, we got that book, the esteemed, uh... Was it Innov Innovator? I don't know what it's called. Uh, we got this, and I think I'm already using it. Uh, something else, I don't know. Why the fuck Steam Joe won't charge? I have no clue. But, let's talk about the progress we've been doing here. So, this is a flash boiler component. Uh, and if we open up Flex, now we can see this right here. Flash boiler component. This was, this cost way too much brass to make. And, uh, aka all the grind part I was doing. And I got a magma crucible. I don't know why I never just use that. It's probably better than the other crucible. But yeah, I did all this. Uh, you need to make, what is it? Eight parts because it's like a whole thing you gotta build here. I forget the word for the things that you gotta build. Multi part. Something I don't fucking know. But you do that and then you get a flash boiler, which is a way, way bigger uh, thing. This bucket is really glitchy. And it works on some mods, but it doesn't work on some other mods. It's kind of weird, and I don't like how glitchy this is. It just gets rid of my bucket every time, which is kind of weird. Uh, yeah, look, it, it, it is weird. But yeah, we power it up, it sucks in coal like a fucking prostitute, and then, you know, you get a lot more fuel. And I got this going on right here. I probably showed this off before. Probably not, but I probably showed off the steam heater. I got this upstairs, so when I want to smelt something or cook food, then I have it here. Thank goodness for that. And I got a bunch of steam beef. Thanks. Uh, but yeah, we got the steam hammer, it's doing good, it's not really to put in it right now, uh, and then we got a steam filler, now, we're gonna take off my armor, I put on gold for this armor because, look, it gives you, I have an entrepreneur's top hat too, it gives you, uh, extra experience, which is really good, I'm level 46, and I only killed a good couple of mobs, but, I also put this on, now this thing costs a fuck ton of brass, it's heavily reinforced exosuit tank, which allows me to store, look how much that's allowed, allowed to store now, it's kind of insane, but look, look at the recipe. So, I made this one first. This one's fairly simple. And then there's this one. Look at this. That's so much brass. That's a lot of brass. And then I made this filling pad right here. Now, this filling pad is kind of awesome. Now, check this out. We just start walking backwards here. We get sucked on. And boom. It is filling me up as we speak. Look at that. It's going into my pack and everything. That shit is awesome. And uh, it's really fast. It's actually extremely fast. And uh, that's very nice to have. Just look at that thing go up. Wasn't that like almost... Wasn't that like in the middle? We're just gonna wait until that gets to 500,000. But yeah, very cool. And it's actually pretty easy to make. And uh, you just stand on it for quicker refueling. And uh, yeah, you're good to go. Now something I want to try out here is uh, steam wings. So, so we need brass... And then we need copper. Do we have? No, we gotta make. We gotta make some copper. Uh, is it too too much jiggies? I mean, what the fuck? Uh, where's the? There it is. We're gonna make that. I'm gonna try out these glider wings because I haven't tried them out yet. But yeah, we're kind of doing like a tour here. I uh, got a whole fuck ton of heads. And uh, we're gonna do a little tour here because it's been a while since I recorded like an actual episode recently. So I've just been doing off camera work. But look, we got the sniper turrets here. These are really easy to make. So, lapis block on the bottom, fence in the middle, and then dispenser on top. Thanks, uh, utility mobs, because these guys are extremely useful. Keep mobs out of here. But uh, let's go over here. Uh, I'll show off this first. This is the Ender IO area. This will have an episode sooner or later. Uh, 
this is my enchantment table area and that is my farming area now this don't worry about that that's kind of broken right now i think but uh we won't worry about it for now and we will go ahead and do this okie dokie that was actually really fast i don't know why i did jump up there but you know save some time so it's good i mean three of them didn't I? all right i guess we're not doing a jump cut we're just gonna we're just, you're just gonna watch me make some more of this but uh, no problem i brought some extra copper out here aka a whole single bar yeah, this is kind of gets repetitive, and like I said, I'm gonna hopefully somehow automate this or something around the line, along the lines of that. Not around the lines, along the lines. Oh shoot, we need one more. We need one more. Break in, break in, go. Quick, break in and run. Okay, so let's go back over here. Got a couple bar. Apparently, I have two plate molds. Uh, this was an ingot mold. I don't know what happened, but it's now a plate mold apparently. Uh, yep. Take that. All right, let's craft this. We're gonna go in here to craft it. I can craft it out there, but I want to go in here, just because we got our uh, bench in here, or whatever the fuck this is called. It's in here. All right, so we're gonna do this. Oh man, I'm not gonna have the ability to fly. I'm not used to this. But I don't know how you work this. How do you work this? Nah, let's let's do this. Uh, now I can glide like a chicken and no steam cars. This steam power chest piece upgrade will deploy when I start falling. Too fast, too slow, my fall. But this can be disabled by hitting shift. Okay, so yeah, he pretty much just turns it chicken, which is not that great. Uh, if you have the uh, the boots that make you jump really high, those will help a lot. But as you see, yeah, this is actually really pretty cool. You just straight up glide and uh, probably saves you a good amount of power. Since I have dusters on, I go really fast. I get those things that hang on the side of me, uh, which look kind of weird. But yeah, let's let's go up here. Let's go up here and do a glide. Do gliding and glide glide. Uh, hey, hey. Does anybody remember that thing on Disney Channel, Shorty with Short Shorts? It just popped into my head when I said that. Does anybody remember that? Apparently, that's like a tongue twister. Fucking ignorant Disney stars. Am I right? <laughs> All right, let's uh, go up here on this like very high snow. Holy shit! And uh, let's let's glide. Oh my god, this is cool! I feel like fucking Hawkman, Birdman, the dude. Yeah, the dude is fun. Look at this shit. So this kind of cool, but it's not as cool as a jetpack. As cool as it is, the jetpack is pretty fucking cool. I'm not gonna lie, dude. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's go get our jetpack. Fuck this shit. I don't want this on. I don't want that on. I'm sorry. This, this is cooler. My bad, dude. Uh, is there any plates that I made recently? No, because I don't own anything. I'm trying to get Ryan to make me some elementium things so we can spawn pixies. Which would be awesome. But yeah, we're gonna do something in this episode, I hope. I hope. I really hope I get something done. Mega Slime. I did that off camera with Ryan. Um... Dude, I'll find something to do. Don't you worry about it, alright? Okay. So, today I'm taking my steam-powered gadgets into the Twilight Forest because we're gonna do some of this mod until uh, we get some more, until we all get a session together. But right now, it's uh, the middle of the week. And uh, we can't do that right now, but MLK Day is coming up very soon. So, uh, we should be able to do something because of that. You know, we'll have some free time. And uh, we're gonna be fighting the Naga. Starting it off strong, we're gonna hopefully have an episode per boss. And uh, I was talking about we're doing seasons, so we can like switch up our uh, our team, whatever team we're on. Like I'm on the Steam team, Ryan's on the the uh, Botany team. And uh, once we switch, uh, once season two comes around, you know we'll all switch. And uh, Dakota is doing the Twilight Force as his sort of thing, as his like faction right now. But uh, ooh, did I actually click that? I actually put that. Yeah, I did. Uh, I didn't think it would fit because mods. Uh, but yeah, Dakota's doing this as his mod because I said, hey, let me add in like a third faction that you can do so we don't have two people doing the same faction. And now Dakota's doing the Twilight Force. But I wanted to do it so I don't have to do like a third season just to get it out of the way. And that's exactly what's about to go on. We about to wreck him. Uh, we're gonna use this, put our weapons that we have to our to use. And, uh, let's fuck up a naga, shall we? Alright, this dude lags the server sometimes because he's got them body segments. I don't know, the entities. There's too many entities to handle. Okay, why did I shoot an arrow? I, I can't ask you the question. Uh, 
Still though, why did I shoot that? Empty this. Empty this. I'm up. I'm up. I can't die. I seriously can't die. Here we go, here we go. Bam! Oh, I'm gone. I'm gone. Come get me, big boy. Yeah, you can't get me up here, dog. Well, you probably can. We're gonna jump down. Is he charging? Is he charging? He's not charging. Right, let's wait for a charge. Alright, he blinked. He blinked. I'm sorry. He blinked. Right. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, get dodged. Oh, he's fuck. He still came for me, though. He still came. Pause. Alright, let's, uh... What the fuck? Yeah, I'm just trying to kill this raven over here, dude. If you insist on getting wrecked... Oh, shit, he's actually doing a lot of damage. Why are you, why are you doing so much damage to me, dude? That's not nice. Hey, don't fuck up that bird. That bird is doing anything to you. You get out of here, you fucking fake snake. Making all those noises. I think I'm rattling. What do you think you are? A fucking rattlesnake? Ah, you're a fucking... A naga. Like, what even is a naga? Cause some sort of serpent? You're about to get fucked up. Serpent, some fucking Medusa reject. Medusa reject! I didn't, oh, I did pick up skills. I was about to be kind of pissed off there. Well, I got that looting, which I don't really think affects it at all. This Ender Sword is fucking awesome. It's uh, from, from uh, the, the Ender IO. And it's literally called the Ender. I didn't name it. It's actually pretty easy to make. Not really. The items you use to get it was kind of kind of hard to get those items. So we need to make a, a magic map now. I have a lot of the map uh, discovered, and me and Dakota took on a good bit of them. Well, I helped Dakota. I didn't really help him with some of them. The early ones I did, but I had to start watching him just do everything just because I don't have well the new progression system in uh, Twilight Forest. Uh, and he's killing a bunch of the bosses, so I'm not, like, allowed to actually, you know, follow him along with everything. Because I'd have to kill another boss just like that, just to follow him along. Which I don't really like that feature. I know it can be turned off, but, uh, since I'm not hosting the server directly from my computer, it's kind of hard to turn features like that off. But, uh, yeah, that should do a good bit of this episode. There's a bunch of... Uh, no, that should be it for this episode. I don't know if I'll wear any of the armor here. Maybe I will, maybe I won't. Probably you won't. Maybe I'm not. But uh, I'm probably gonna go kill another Naga if I do wear armor. So I wanna make sure I have a good set of it. But uh, I gotta make a map and then go out into the middle of nowhere and just wear that map. And uh, it should be good. Let's do you know how, rare, how rare those are in 1.7.10. Kind of rare. Not that rare, but kind of rare. But yeah, I'll see you guys in the next episode. 